Tech Zoo fans, thank you so much for checking in on our Facebook Live. This Facebook Live is sponsored by Jiffy Lube of Greater Sacramento, and we are so, so grateful to Jiffy Lube for supporting the Sacramento Zoo. If you too are interested in supporting the Sacramento Zoo uh, during this time, feel free to visit our website, saczoo.org, to learn more about our emergency relief fund. Today we are here with some primate keepers, and we're going to be learning about chimpanzees and some training. All right, guys. You guys look ready to go. <laughs> All right, do you guys want to introduce yourselves? Yeah, so my name is Andrea. I'm a primate keeper here at the Sacramento Zoo. Um, this is my coworker Bamboo, who's also a primate keeper, and we take care of all of the apes, monkeys, and lemurs here at the Sacramento Zoo. Awesome, and we're going to be doing some training. We've got some little treats here. What do we got? We have some red peppers, chickpeas, and sunflower seeds in the shell, so a lot Ooh. of choices. Very, very nice. All right, everybody looks ready. So here at the zoo, we do a lot of voluntary training with our chimpanzees. Good. Um, our facilities team has created this really cool portal. This is just a metal tube that goes right into the exhibit. So kind of like when you're training your dog at home, you ask them to do a behavior. If you ask them to sit and they sit, you say, good boy, and you give them a treat. This is how we can reinforce them and give them their treats. Um, today I'm going to start with chickpeas. Yes. Okay. All right. And for those who are just tuning in, we're here at the Sacramento Zoo. We're uh, showcasing some chimp training with our primate mm -hmm. keepers. If you guys have any questions, feel free to okay. leave them in the comment section below and Good. we will be happy to get to those questions. So we have five chimpanzees here at the zoo. We have Amelia up here yeah. joining us for a training session. Um, she really, yeah. really enjoys training. Um, and all of the training that we do here is voluntary, but she always chooses to participate. She really, really enjoys it and she really enjoys mm -hmm. getting treats. Ooh, Addie and Ellie, hi! Thank you so much for tuning in. Can we open? Open. Good. Yep. So Amelia is 30 years old, um, and her daughter is also in the troop. Maria right here with her back to us. And then Maria's father is Pablo. And right over here we have Dougie, who is our alpha male chimpanzee. He is 19 years old. Very and nice. So do you want to talk a little bit more about these behaviors and why they're important and why we do training here at the Sacramento Zoo? Yes, of course. So a lot of the behaviors that Bamboo is asking the chimpanzees to do um, are presenting different body parts. So Bamboo will use nonverbal cues to ask the chimpanzees to present a specific body part. So she's asking Pablo, Oh, Amelia might give Amelia. So she's asking Amelia to give her ear right now. So this is really useful. So making these behaviors voluntary. If, for example, they had a small scrape on their arm or something like that, um, we could voluntarily ask for that body part and they can show us that body part here Amelia. at the windows where we can get a close-up look to see how serious um, an injury might be. They will also open their mouth so we can get a good look at the inside yeah. of their mouth. That's great. Yeah, so a lot of great <laughs> behaviors so that these guys can be voluntary participants in their care, like open mouth or letting the keepers kind of check out their body and kind of see how they're doing. Right. Ellie, age two, wants to know how old the oldest chimpanzee is. The oldest one that we have here at the zoo is Joey, and he is 58 years old. 58. Awesome. Aaliyah, age nine, would like to know what their names are. So here we have our mother and daughter pair right here. On the right side is Amelia, and then her daughter is Maria right here. Very nice. Addie, age four, wants to know if they can swim. Chimpanzees are not very good swimmers. Um, they are super dense and have a lot of muscle mass. Um, yep. So they uh, avoid the deep water. Yeah, yeah. Sometimes they like to splash a little bit in shallow water, Good. like their pond here. Yes, sometimes they might want to play in the water, but they are definitely not swimmers. <laughs> <laughs> Good. 
And again, guys, if you're just tuning in, we're here at the Sacramento Zoo Facebook Live. We're here with the primate keepers, learning a bit about chimpanzees, checking out a training session. This Facebook Live is sponsored by <laughs> Jiffy Lube of Greater Sacramento. We are so grateful to them for supporting the zoo. And if you too are interested in supporting the zoo, check out our website, saczoo.org, and learn more about our emergency <laughs> relief fund. If you guys have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comment section. Questions about the chimpanzees and the training. All right, we've got some questions coming in. Gabe, age six, wants to know if they have a favorite food and what it is. That's a good question. These guys love all sorts of food. Um, their favorite food are definitely special treats like Wait. they're getting today, like chickpeas. They really love nuts and craisins and raisins. But Ooh. they enjoy a lot of the food that we give here, um, and they're part of their daily diet. A lot of seasonal fruits and vegetables that are commissary team preps for them. Um, sure. They enjoy it all. Awesome. All right. Abby, age seven, also had a question about what they ate, so we could go over that a little bit again. But also, a uh, double question, do they like the hot or the cold? Um, so these guys are native to Africa, where temperatures can often yeah. vary, but they're super used to the warm temperatures here yeah. in Sacramento. Um, so here to regulate their temperatures, if it's super cold, we uh, <laughs> provide them with lots of bedding and blankets and stuff like that. And they'll also sit in the sun and find a nice place to warm up Perfect. if it's cold. Awesome. And then again, one more time, Andrea, what are all their names and ages? Yeah, so we have a group of five chimps here at the zoo. Our youngest one is Dougie, who is right here sitting next to Pablo. He is 19. Um, Maria, oh, Dougie is 18, I'm sorry. Maria here is 19. Her mother right here next to her is Amelia, who's 30 years old. And Pablo right next to Dougie is 29. And our oldest chimpanzee is Joey, who is 58 years old. Awesome, thank you so much for running through our whole troop there. And again, if you're just um, okay. checking this out, we are here um, with our chimpanzees and some primate keepers. Sorry. So if you guys have any questions about the chimps, please let us know. Jenna, age mm -hmm. nine, is wondering what the lifespan of chimps is. So in human care, they definitely live a lot longer than they do in the wild. And I think the oldest <laughs> chimp that's in human Good. care right now is 60 years old, which is super awesome. Um, and here at the zoo, we have a 58-year-old ourselves, Mr. Joey. Awesome. So Priya, age seven, wants to know um, why you guys don't go in the same space as the chimpanzees. That's a super good question. So these guys are one of the four great ape species. They're not monkeys. And as great apes, they're super large and super strong. They're actually about six times stronger than a human. So to just stay safe, um, most facilities, almost all facilities, will use protected contact with these guys. Oh. <laughs> a little bit of vocalization. <laughs> Got some things to say. Yeah, so. so protected contact. Yep, very strong animal. So we definitely ha always have a barrier between us and an animal that is very strong and potentially could be dangerous. Addie and Ellie want to know if they ever had babies. Good. So Maria right here, who's accepting some chickpeas, was the last baby here at the Sacramento Zoo, but she's not so much a baby anymore. Mm -hmm. She is 18 oh. years old. Awesome. And Andrea is wondering if you could explain the difference between an ape and a monkey. It is a real easy difference. So monkeys have tails and Maria apes belly. do not have a tail. So just look at their back right. end and you belly. can tell whether they're a monkey or an ape. Billy. Sounds good. Thank you, Andrea. They are loving those are chickpeas here? today. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Anna okay, wants good. to know if there is a hierarchy within the five chimps here in the group. Yeah, that's another super good question. So Dougie, who is actually our youngest male, is our dominant male. Um, chimp social structure is very complex, very yeah. interesting to observe, and it changes often, so it's very dynamic. Um, for example, Pablo was a former alpha male in this group, as well as Joey being a former oh, alpha yeah. male in this group. But um, Dougie is our alpha male. Awesome. 
For those of you just tuning you in, again, we're here at the Sacramento oh, yeah. Zoo at our chimpanzee habitat <laughs> doing some training <laughs> with some primate keepers. If you guys have yeah. any questions, feel free to leave them in the comment section below. And again, let's see what they're eating. We have chickpeas, red bell pepper, chickpeas. and sunflower seeds. Ooh, delicious. And then we've got this really handy training port. Do you want to just talk about it yeah. quickly? So our facilities team has fabricated this training port that, <laughs> Hello. that allows us to reinforce the chimpanzees. So we'll ask them for behavior, and when they do the correct behavior, we will reinforce it by placing a treat right through that tube. Awesome. Thank you, facilities team. That's really, really great. <laughs> All right, guys, thank you so much for tuning in today to our Facebook Live. Again, this is sponsored by Jiffy Lube of Greater Sacramento, and we are so thankful to Jiffy Lube for supporting the Sacramento Zoo. If you, too, want to support the Sacramento Zoo, feel free to visit our website, saczoo.org, to learn more about our emergency relief fund. I hope you guys are having a really great day. <laughs> And the chimps really loved kind of showing off for you guys today. Thank you so much, Primate Team. Bye, guys.